Welcome back to the vlog. This edition is at the start of December. Uh, as I'm recording this, um, there's a light dusting of snow outside. But I don't think it's going to last long and I don't think it's going to settle. And I've got um, herbal tea, mint tea. I'm going to try and lose a bit of weight. Um, so I have... What do I do? Three times a week I do without my milk and sugar and some other bits and pieces. And then I just have black coffee, which I've always liked black coffee. Um, and then after I have my two cups of black coffee, um, it's all about herbal tea, mint tea. I like mint tea. Got used to that from uh, all the years I lived in Germany. Right, let's put that down. <coughs> in this edition of the blog, lots going on. Daily life for Tam and me here in the village in northwest uh, Bosnia and Herzegovina. But before we, uh, before we start, you must probably notice, I hope that you are able to notice, there are no ads running throughout um, the length of the video. I suppose YouTube does put them on the start. I can't stop that. But we had monetized the channel for some time. Um, and then I also follow a lot of people who do longer form vlogs, like our vlogs here, nine minutes, 10 minutes, 11 minutes. And when you get over eight minutes, YouTube puts ads, or you can ask YouTube to put ads in um, to the video itself. And a lot of the people that I follow have longer vlogs. It was driving me nuts uh, all the time when it stopped and then this video had to play automatically. Then it was followed by another automatic ad and sometimes the one that you had to wait five seconds to, to get past. And in the end, I thought to myself, wow, if this is doing my head in, what's it like for you? It's just not right. Oh, I hope that you like that. If you do like the demonetization of the channel, let us know. That would make us feel so happy. So, right, enough of that. Let's get on with this week's edition of Living in Bosnia and Herzegovina. By the way, episode 15. Oh my god. It's lovely. It's still young. Right. Come and see this. You love your wine, don't you? I do. Quincy is new. Like. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Smells, isn't it? Is it gone off? It's fucking not. Is it dead? <laughs> It's dead. What do you think? Oh, it's. Glass? It smells like dog poo. Are you upset? Uh, no. Are I you? Knew, up I knew it's not gonna be good. It's not gonna be good. But we have some apples. We are Tamara and David, an Anglo-Balkan couple who live in a village in beautiful northern Bosnia and Herzegovina. Here on our channel, we take you along with us during our daily lives, and also to the places we discover on our trips away. From everyday life to culture and food, we'll show you what it's like for us living in this much misunderstood country. We're looking forward to you joining us. Remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss a video. Is this your idea? Yes. My idea. Is this a new tradition for Chirachini? Yes, I I've seen this on Pinterest. See, Pinterest is a great thing for Inspiratia, for uh, DIY, DIY uh, project. Fred Rags our Meister, he does everything. So this is, this is going to be a Christmas tree? Yes? Yes. And we're going to put lights in these holes. Color of Christmas tree? Red and green. Red and green. Yes, watch. Oh. Phoebe. Phoebe. Phoebe.
It's a Monday evening, it's dark, all the lights are on, my goodness. Wasn't all that long ago, was it, when it was nice and sunny and so warm. But uh, yeah, just popped into the vlog to tell you that we've got this. This is from, uh, well, Sam went to a new shopping centre near us in um, Klaschnitzer. And she said, close your eyes and put your hands around this and what can you feel? And I, obviously I could feel it was a jar. Um, and I said, that's got to be an Indian sauce, a curry sauce. And she says, no. And I opened my eyes up and wow. Um, I love Turkish food. I really, really do. Maybe that's why I love being in Bosnia-Herzegovina because there's lots of Turkish influence in the food. Uh, and we follow, or I follow at least, a channel called Turkish Food Travel um, from a lady based in uh, Istanbul. She does some wonderful things. It's a couple of really cool food channels that I follow from Turkey. And it was how to make, what she had was how to make rose jam. Um, you know that they're famous for Turkish delight and everything. And this, I don't know if you can see it, this is rose jam. And Tam and I are really looking forward to eating this. Um, we really would like to do it now, but we must probably do it for breakfast. For a Brit, the thought of rose jam doesn't quite jive. But how long ago was it that I was in Britain being a real Brit? Yeah. If I can remember to have the camera with me, we'll do a little tasting session. Rose jam. How cool. Waking up in the mornings now isn't the same as it's been throughout the summer and the start of autumn when we've had at least blue skies and a little bit of warmth. Now it's very, very chilly. And as you can see, we get misty mornings now. Um, today, I've tried to put the drone up in the hope that I can show you some of the frost and some of the mist that makes the village look beautiful but in a different way from all those beautiful greens and lush colors of the summer through the browns and reds of yeah our leaf peeping season though that's quite small but I think also the frosty village looks quite glamorous and beautiful in its own way my only problem of course is in the past, I've flown my drone a little bit above the mist and it's lost its way. And on a couple of occasions, I've nearly lost the drone. But you can see how wonderful it really looks. Autumn can be beautiful in its own way too. Don't you agree? Central heating. Lasagna for dinner. How cool is that? Wings going to be marinated shortly. Cocta for me. Nice wine for Tam. And some new wine glasses. It is trying to snow. Actually, it says on the weather forecast that it's not going to uh, stay. It's not going to settle. But it's getting heavier. So I'm going to go back in the office. It's trying to snow. Fui. Do you want to see it out the back window as well? I'll open it just a little bit because I don't want to lose all my heat. Winter's here then, isn't it? Winter's... Got to close the window properly. There you go. Winter's here. So that's it, another week in the village here in northwest Bosnia and Herzegovina. Tam and I do really, really appreciate the fact that you take the time to watch. 
uh, and that you give us those thumbs up as well. Oh, by the way, if you're picking this up for the first time, or maybe you've forgotten to do it before, please do subscribe to the channel. Do give us a thumbs up and press that notification button. It does mean so very much to us. As I said at the start of this episode, we've demonetized the channel, but uh, if you'd like to support us in any way, small or large, um, with a donation, there are links below. And if you are a company that would like to do a collaboration, you think it would be beneficial to you for us to uh, work together. I mean, we have people not only here in the Western Balkans, but across the world watching a channel. Please do get in touch. The weather, well, as you've seen, the mists are rolling in most mornings. We've had our first flurry of snow. Didn't last long, but the snow will be here, trust me, in uh, January, February time. And you can laugh and giggle as you see me try and dig uh, a pathway <laughs> from the house um, to the road. Thank you once again from Tam and I, as I said, for joining us. And uh, please do share with your friends, especially if you've got friends who are from the Western Balkans, Bosnia Herzegovina, definitely. Or maybe people that are from Croatia, Montenegro, Northern Macedonia, Serbia and Slovenia too. Uh, if you want to tell them about this channel, that would be really cool. Until next time, do stay safe wherever you are in these very, very challenging times that we're still coping with.